Even though she finished with the best record on the team in singles matches her first year, Caroline Price was an unsteady player and coach Brian Kolbas expected more. Last year she she struggled a little bit, okay, and um, I thought that she was capable of having a better freshman year. So I think she had a kind of a sense of urgency to kind of, you know, take her freshman year and learn from it and get and get a lot better. And she did. Caroline is undefeated in singles matches this season and she's lost only one set. This impressive streak has her ranked 33rd in the nation, a position that could open the doors to the NCAA tournament. That would be unusual given her ranking on the Carolina team. Normally, uh, the 4 or 5 player on the team does not get into the tournament individually at the end of the year. So my goal is to continue to win all my matches to give me the opportunity to get into that tournament and then I, I want to win it. <laughs> and according to coach Brian Kolbas, she has the potential to make it to the tournament. I think she can. I mean, if she stays focused and you know takes it one match at a time, uh, you know, I think she's done a really good job. She's had a lot of good, good wins this year, so I think she's definitely in a good position to, to accomplish that, that goal. Caroline is only a sophomore, but she's ready to take on more responsibilities. Coach already said this year that he wanted me to step up, be a leader, so I've been really trying on the court, but next year I feel like I can be a leader on and off the court a lot more. If she keeps winning all her singles matches, it might be hard to improve her leadership on the court, but if we believe what we see here, she might need to get a little bit better at cheering. In Chapel Hill, I'm Theo Manval.